Hi you guys, this is Misty with Cancerian Chronicles. Welcome or welcome back. Um, I am being guided to do a completely channeled message, no cards. So um, we're going to see what, what we get. All right. I will be editing out um, long pauses because when I channel, um, that does take um, a lot more energy time and effort than when I use the cards okay um, I was guided to write the word lover boy someone needs to know that they are dealing with a cheater um, is basically what I'm getting um, you already have some type of suspicion I'm getting uh, what they had me write was mail on mail so um, Either you are a male and your lover is a male and that kind of lets you know um, if you've been kind of wondering um, if your person is being unfaithful, but also for some of you guys, okay, I'm getting a no for that. So then it's going to be this other option, um, which is, um, this is for a female, you are dealing with a male who is dealing with a male. So um, the person that you are suspecting them of cheating, but it's kind of like you're not getting um, any type of evidence of them being with another uh, girl, another woman is because they're not, they're with a, a male, they're with the same sex, okay? Um, I feel like whoever you are, you are already kind of suspicious um, I don't really want to talk about that. That seems really graphic, but um, I guess someone has changed kind of um, in the way that they're wanting to be intimate with you. So we'll just kind of leave it at that. I'm here face down, face down. So they're wanting a lot more of that. I'm hearing runaway love. I'm getting the sense of like um, your guidance is for you to just leave that situation completely to do not like there's not um, there's nothing to talk about with this person not because of their um, preferences it has something to do with number one that they are sneaking and cheating so there's something about that but also um, what this person does they're not using protection so it has something to do with your own health and safety. Yeah. Anything else for that one? Okay. Okay. Mandy. Patrick. Lewis. Megan. Okay. That's all they're giving me. For some names, uh, first, middle, last, anything else with that message? Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna, um, I'm writing what I'm hearing. It says, um, wonderful day. But what I was hearing was, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood, a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Would you be my? Could you be my? Would you be my neighbor? So what about that? So that's not good, okay. Someone is being guided or um, the guidance is for someone. Okay, I wrote down child predator. Someone needs to um, look at the registry for something. I'm hearing keep your friends close, keep your enemies closer. This is about knowing, being aware of um, who is in the neighborhood because whoever you are, you have children and you need to be mindful. I'm seeing eyes. Some, someone is watching another person's kids. I'm hearing um, the voice of that um, 
that guy, the old guy on Family Guy. Um, you'll know that this message is for you because you have been kind of, um, I'm hearing sus, right? So someone, you've been suspicious of someone, either you've seen how someone was looking at your kid or you felt weird or, you know, there's something about that. So someone needs to go and check out the registry. Okay. Anything else? I'm hearing the song, I Got Holes. I got holes in different area codes. What is that about? Wandering eye. Someone has a wandering eye. This is for someone like if you're dealing with uh, someone who travels, possibly um, they travel a lot. They travel for work. I'm hearing, uh, well, I'm writing. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm hearing abort mission. Someone's going to get caught. I'm hearing something about caught with your pants down. For some of you guys, this is a truck driver. I'm hearing, um, what is it, Destiny's Child? If you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. Whoever you are, um, if this is your situation and you're living with uh, someone, um, but possibly you're engaged or, you know, just kind of long term, like, long-term dating um this person won't put a ring on it or something like that it has something to do with them having a wandering eye and um the reason that i'm being guided to share this message um is what i wrote was get your paper together so if you're someone who usually likes to react um, you're being guided to do something quietly. So that means get your fine, get your finances, get your money in order. Don't leave without having your paper together, right? So I'm getting the sense of like, um, this has something to do with making sure that you are secure, that you're stable, right? making sure that you're okay. So don't just do like a knee jerk reaction. The guidance is um, for you to get your money, get your affairs in order, like financially speaking. Do not, I'm, I'm feeling this right here. Do not say anything to anyone. I'm hearing the word ops. Do not share this information with whoever you deem to be close family or close friends, because I feel like there is some type of op. someone is an op, right? Someone talks to um, your your partner, your significant other, um, and you may not be aware of just how close this person is. Don't tell your bestest of best friends. Don't tell anyone. This is not about you being in like physical, like in, in any danger, like as far as physically speaking, this is just some type of guidance to make sure that you are financially safe and secure. Get your affairs in order, whatever that all entails for you. Anything else? I'm hearing the song, let me know, let me know. I don't even really know that song. So what do we need to know about that? Okay, um, this is a different, a new message, but someone wants to get back, um, whoever this is for, someone wants to get back in your good graces. So that means that they must have done something to um, hurt you or betray you in some way. This is something that you guys have like already split up. You're already um, in separation. 
We are in Kangen next to you. You may have this person blocked. I'm getting a lot of back pain right now. Why? <laughs> Someone was a pain in the ass. I'm hearing, and that will never change. Someone was putting a lot of burdens on your back. Someone was, um, yeah, putting a lot on your plate. They were not taking off. They weren't taking things off of your plate. They were burdening you with more things to do, more responsibilities. This is a person I'm hearing equally yoked. So this is a person that you guys weren't necessarily on the same page. You were not equally yoked. Um, yeah. Spiritually, financially, sexually, emotionally, like whoever this is for, like it's, I, I'm not, I'm hearing like oil and, and water. I'm hearing Lady Gaga, bad romance. I'm hearing that you did the right thing. I'm hearing uh, protect, protect your peace. Someone's trying to call me. So, um, yeah, someone's trying to knock you off track, off course, off your path, distractions. Anything else? Someone's gonna come in pretending like they've changed, like they see, um, I'm hearing, I see the light, I see the light. They don't see the light. They don't. I'm hearing something about step into the light, Caroline. Was that, um, what was that movie with Hannibal Lecter? Hannibal, or I, I don't know. Hannibal, maybe that was the name of it, Hannibal Lecter where he was a cannibal. Makes me feel like this person um, just wants to consume you, meaning like all of your energy. They use you for your emotional labor and your physical labor so um, I'm seeing a TikTok that I saw earlier where the guy had like 99 problems and the girlfriend had one and she would lean her head over and that one problem like transferred automatically to him. That's what this person is trying to do. This person recognizes um, who you are or just kind of like your ability um, some type of like ability that you have to find solutions, to transmute, um, you know, certain types of energy. But this person is just continuing to take without giving anything back. Like they're not lightening your load. They're just, they continue to bring in or create burdens for you. <sighs> yeah. I'm getting the sense of like someone who creates havoc wherever they go. Any relationship that this person has been in, um, friendships, work, like it's like this person, I'm hearing, you dropped a bomb on me. Like wherever this person goes, they just make a mess. They just wreck havoc and they don't care. Yeah. Anything else? I feel like that's all the messages. So 
that's all I have. I hope that these messages were helpful. Um, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe. Um, I love you and have a beautiful day. Bye now. Thanks.